Hey, what's up guys? Today we are going to be playing this pretty cool Uno game that I recently got at Walmart and originally the price was for this is like $29 but then we waited just a little bit longer and uh, the next thing you know they had sell it for like 13 bucks versus Universal because Universal has their prices way sky high. I'm a firm believer now because when we went there to go for the last day for Jurassic Park, uh, they were selling it for like $40 just for this game. When you can get it over at Walmart or Target uh, for like 13 bucks, if you wait patient enough, you could definitely go pick one of these up too as well. Uh, you know, we've been playing Uno for a while now, and Uno's like one of our favorite games to be able to play. So here's what it looks like out of the box. I was going to do an unboxing, but we already. Uh, we pretty much already took it out of the box. Of course, it takes uh, three C batteries, just like those regular fat batteries, basically. And that's what the product looks like once you take it out of the box. But of course, you have to put those little things back there together in order for you to, uh, you know, complete the whole thing. But overall, it looks really cool. I mean, I'm loving it. I like every detail on the Dilophosaurus, and of course it fell off again. That's <laughs> already happened to us twice already. But, you know, it does stay on. It's just, it stays on ever so slightly, which I don't know why it just pops out. But I love the details on it. Someone actually uh, painted it to look more realistic, but, you know... I'm not going to be painting mine anytime soon, so we are definitely going to be playing this game for sure. I forget, today is Friday and they always have fireworks going on at the Dodger Stadium because we live, uh, we can basically hear the fireworks going on from here. You can feel the fireworks from here. Yeah, you, it rumbles <laughs> the whole entire house, which is pretty insane. Here's what the cards look like when you take it out of the box. It looks just like this. That's pretty awesome. It says Jurassic World Uno Attack. And the colors are much more brighter than the Ghostbusters uh, reboot version of Uno that we have. And, uh, of course, we can't really take this on a plane if we decide to go back home and play this on a plane because all the cards will be spinning out all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> People on the plane will be like, you're playing this while we're chilling? You know, yeah, why not? I mean, it's it's Uno. <laughs> It'll just be like 52 pickup, basically. So we're going to go play this right now. We'll see how it goes. I mentioned that the cards come in two packs. One over there and one over here. There's going to be a lot of cards today. Let's we'll, we'll see how it goes. We just like literally found out something so hilarious. Now, uh, accordingly, of course, is what the game does. But when you push down with the tip of your finger or your index, like at least, go for it, like at least... One several times Two, three four <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so hilarious I love it <laughs> I like the noises that it makes that's that's truly cool so yeah you, you press down and it does make noises when you put those three C size batteries in and uh, yeah that is like Seriously, that is so cool. I was laughing my my butt off, uh, you know, because that was like the coolest thing ever. High props for Mattel for doing an awesome job on this, and I'm also loving the details <laughs> on how everything Do is. Do not fire at point blank range. Really? Uh, it just like fired on the bed. <laughs> That's awesome. I got the fan rolling. In case you're wondering that over there. We're gonna be playing this game. It's hot in here right now, so we get the fan on. All right, let's do this. I 
supposed to grab the car and you grab it. <laughs> There's something wrong with this. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Oh, that is messed up. Do I tap it? If you don't have the, if you don't have the fire rate, you know, yeah. Oh, hang on. Well, I'm gonna switch the color to. <laughs> How did it know it was supposed to draw out? Oh, that is okay. That is wow. All right. Um, <laughs> what was the color? Red. Yeah, it was red. It's very insane. You gotta solve that. Kingdom of I cars. So too. It is. 
Can you hear me, Tilaposaurus? <laughs> Today's series is about this motion sensor game. What about that? Um, got a problem here. like a skipping point. it's game over already as it is uh wow it's voice activated there's no way yeah because every time when you put a card down it knows a certain card i think it's got like a some sort of sensor that it knows what card you put down uh, this is a very interesting game so anyways we're gonna play this for ourselves and if you guys enjoyed this video let us know if you want to see some more uh, videos of just like this for us playing this game a lot more. You know, because this is a fun game, definitely for sure. And then when you talk, and then when you touch the top part, it's all rubbery. It's got that nice uh, feel. You know, it's like an actual dino skin for sure, but it's all rubber. So, uh, anyways, guys, if you enjoy this video, subscribe. And as always. If you haven't seen yesterday's video when we were at Universal Studios, sad day for all. It was definitely something that's, you know, out of the ordinary and just be able to ride it one last time. And it's it's a classic ride, definitely for sure. And as always, we'll see you guys later. We're gonna be going to Vegas on. Actually, it's gonna be some more content there for you guys. What day are we going to Vegas? Sunday. We're going there on Sunday. It's definitely going to be awesome, and uh, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully, I don't lose once we gamble. But, as always, we'll see you guys later. It's DRUSA. I'm out. Bye, guys.